My name is Klaus Bondem. I'm the mayor for the Technical and Environmental Administration in the uh, city of Copenhagen, the host city of the COP15. It's, I mean, basically it's a structural change we're talking about. And I think that is probably the most important message to get through, that if you want to achieve uh, uh, lowering the CO2 emissions, you have to work with some structures in our cities. I mean, how do we uh, supply the energy? How do we transport ourselves? Uh, how do we construct new parts of the city? How do we uh, work with energy renovation in existing buildings? And, and, and of course, how is our behavior as citizens? Uh, we have our bicycles. Um, about 40% of uh, uh, workplaces and study places in the city of Copenhagen are reached by bicycle every day. And uh, over 50% of the Copenhagen are use their bicycle every single day throughout the year, including me on a rainy day like this. I mean, it is the way to get around in, in our city. And, uh, and then, uh, of course, we are working a lot with the wind turbines. Uh, it's uh, what we call the Danish adventure, it's, it's, it's the wind turbines. It uh, suits our climate very good, and uh, we have also a very positive perception of windmills. There is a, 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 a big line of windmills standing uh, just offshore the city of Copenhagen, and we regard them as a, a very positive image of our city and, and also a, a, a part of the Copenhagen skyline. There is a factor about political courage. I mean, you have to have a a local government or a national government that actually has the courage to take some of these initiatives that, I mean, they might only work a little bit tomorrow or next year or in two years' time, but you have to have a 20, 25 years perspective on this. One of the things that the city of Copenhagen has worked a lot for is to make sure that the roles of cities and local governments are implemented in the Copenhagen Agreement. And especially if the head of, heads of states want immediate actions, then they should look to the cities because we're the ones who can provide the immediate actions actually.